Well, good morning, everyone. Wachuca guy here. And let's see, it's Monday morning about 9.40. And uh, it's July 13th. No, July 12th, excuse me. And we're just out for a little morning ride. And uh, I think uh, on average, uh, our monsoon appears to have started uh, pretty much on time, which is usually within a week or so after the 4th of July. And uh, last couple of days, at least at my home base and with my backyard weather station, uh, had a little over an inch of rain in the past uh, 48 hours. And uh, that's good. About half an inch or so every day for the past two days. And if you can see up over the Wachuca Mountains there, clouds are already starting to build up a little bit. And uh, I think the forecast said there's still about a 40 to 50 percent chance of rain today. Yesterday there was about a 60 percent chance of rain, and uh, I think pretty much the, a good part of the local area got got their 60 percent worth. Anyway, I'm just going to do a short little vlog here. Uh, wanted to conduct kind of a informal little poll where you the viewers of this vlog can vote so to speak or put your comments in and uh, this little vol vote and poll is uh, kind of about a regular high beam headlight in the daytime versus a Modul modulated or I sometimes call it a pulsing bright headlight uh, high beam and uh, another bike route this morning very nice morning actually the humidity is up it's about 82 degrees outside right now so it's very very pleasant but anyway You'll see a couple of video clips here, and uh, pretty much uh, both the same, except in one of them, which I think will be the first video clip. You'll see, uh, coming from a oh, quarter of a mile distance or so, you'll see my Bergman coming toward the camera with uh, just the regular high beam headlights on and the second clip will be same situation except I will have my high beams on with the headlight modulator going so you'll see uh, as again I say pulsing headlight at coming at you so the test and the uh, comments is I would like to know from all of the viewers what caught your eye the most? What caught your attention the most? Just the, the regular high beam headlight or the high beam headlight with the headlight modulator on it? In other words, which was more noticeable to you? Which caught your eye first? The regular high beam or the modulated headlight? Uh, Again, the modulated headlights are supposed to be for safety and supposed to get your attention more. And uh, I just kind of want to know everyone's opinion, everyone's comment. And uh, I've already formed my own, but uh, I'd like to have everyone's opinion. So uh, hope you'll watch the video and uh, put your comments down anyway enjoy the video and I'll look forward to seeing everybody's vote and comments and this is the Wachuca guy 
heading home. And maybe we'll get some more rain this afternoon. Everybody have a good day out there and ride safe. See you on the next vlog.